Hi, Spartan. Welcome in. You can get some yos. Hello. Face came on in one minute, not even getting. I'm cleaning my depression room because I have appraisal tomorrow. <laughs> That's okay. You know, I need to clean my room too. <laughs> but you know, proud of you for doing it. I will sing a song. Okay. We can do that right at the top. Okay, I'm almost done posting. Give me 10 more seconds. Count in your head. Wait, it's the sad song. Bob Watchers, it's the sad song. Okay, I think I'm ready. Three, two, one. Ain't no way everything works. Hello. Good morning, good afternoon. It is Monday, July 29th. 11.06 a.m. I am live right on time. I think I click star stream at like 10.59 or 11 o'clock on the dot. So not early, not late. Perfect timing. I'm not going to sing Lady Gaga. But you know what I could do? I could try a Mariah Carey song. Gotta do my stretches. Also, hi Spartan. Thank you for chatting the Just Starting Soon screen. Welcome in. I can. I haven't sung this song in a long time.
Oh, okay. I had to like sing the chorus in my head to remember the the title. I'm so nervous. Okay. Let's pause the music. I have a lot of tabs open on my computer. Hopefully she doesn't crash the stream. Peace. I use my prime sub on Lacey. Didn't you promise that you would use your prime on me? Or did I tell you that you had to promise it? SMH. But hi, Ethan. Can we get some yos? Hello. Okay, guys. Before we sing the song... As you can see by the title, I am doing the subathon on Thursday. It is going to be a 30 hour cap. Subscriptions are going to be with 10 minutes, bits 200 minutes per 100. Because I was going to do it on Friday, but I might have to do something Friday night. Um, we're not going to Hawaii this weekend. W, we're probably going like either next, 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 or next, next, next weekend. <laughs> but it's, it's not this weekend, so I can still do the subathon on Thursday and Friday. So Oilers. Politely hold, hold, until Thursday. I can probably get bits. Ooh, you know what I'll say? Bits are like a better investment than subscriptions for a subathon. Partially because you know I get a bigger cut, and also, um, since gifted subs and tier ones are more, it's like you might as well just cough up bits and you get like more time out of it. But yeah, so plan for today is simple. We're gonna do the classic. Will you play the? Will you press the button? That way we have a YouTube video for this week. Wait, talking about YouTube. This week's video that I posted on. Let's put the music back on. Um, this week I posted the video, the chess stream from last weekend, and it's already at a hundred views. Holy shit! It's been doing really well. So, guys, make sure you're subbed to the YouTube. We're popping off. Yeah. So, plan for this week. Today, press the button, and then we're going to plan for the subathon. I already have an idea of what I kind of want to do, but we can brainstorm ideas together, because, you know, it's a group effort. And then tomorrow, I have to beat Peace Lock this week. I have to beat it by the first. I have to. So I either am going to do... I'm either going to do Pokemon, the final Elite Four battle tomorrow or Wednesday. And then... I want to do another YouTube video stream. That way we have, like, another edit for the following week. It'll either be... I have two ideas. It depends on, like, how I feel. Because, like, I have to go to the post office sometime this week to mail the recent art orders people placed on Friday. So, yeah. Now, the biking subathon will still be in September. It's just... You know, Peason needs money so she can buy the Hawaii plane ticket to see her grandma's funeral. So, I need, like, money now <laughs> and let's be honest that's why people do some of that you know what i mean <laughs> um it's pokemon emerald i'm about to head into the elite four so we'll do that in one entire stream either tomorrow or wednesday i'm leaning towards tomorrow honestly i need to get that shit done okay so that's the plan for this week like i said after we do the main thing for today we'll plan the subathon together but <laughs> okay don't call me pookie don't call me boo this is your last warning spartan i'm not even kidding this is your last warning if you do that shit again look at me i'm not smiling i will time you out for another day and it will go on your permanent record only my sugar mama can call me that okay now let's sing the song so you can use your channel points to make me sing a song if you want to see a full playlist of all the previous clips, there's a playlist on my YouTube. Click the link. Go we'll watch it later. Whoever guesses the song gets a high five. Press the button to spare Spartan. <laughs> they wish. They wish. Hi, Tooth. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? The only part I know of hot to go is H O T T O G O. That's the only part I know. That's the only part I know. Okay, whoever guesses it gets a million dollars. 
Asterisk, just kidding. I'm gonna try and do the the first verse and the chorus. You guys ready? Put your favorite emotes, your favorite animated emotes in the chat. That'd be great. I didn't mean it when I said I didn't love you so. I should have held on tight. I never should have let you go. I didn't know nothing. I was stupid. I was foolish. I was lying to myself. I could have not fathomed I would ever be without your love. Never imagined I'd be sitting here beside myself. Guess I didn't know you. Guess I didn't know me. But I thought I knew everything. I never felt. The feeling that I'm feeling now that I don't hear your voice Or have you touching kiss your lips cause I don't have a choice Or what I wouldn't give to have you lying by my side right here Cause baby When you left I lost a part of me It's still so hard to believe Come back baby please cause We belong together who else am I gonna lean on when times get rough? Who's gonna talk to me on the phone till the sun comes up? Who is gonna take your place? There ain't nobody better. Oh, baby, baby, we belong together. I haven't sung this song in a long time. And as you can tell, I didn't warm up today at all. Like, <laughs> this, not gonna lie, is like the first time I'm talking for today. But yeah, it's. We Belong Together by Mariah Carey. You know, if I ever go to karaoke, I would choose this one. Do the high note. <laughs> nah, I can't do it. But thank you, Spartan, for redeeming. Thank you. Okay, guys, now for the meat and potatoes. I take voice lessons. And I do goaded Ariana impressions. You know what? You should stream and see what happens. Okay. Are we ready? Guys, say hi, YouTube. This will be an edit. I will edit this. Probably this week. Oh, shoot. Um, I saw you redeemed Spartan calligraphy. We'll do that at the end of stream. Remind me if I forget. So, guys, you know the drill? Say hi, YouTube. Also, I'm going to make sure the audio is removed. <laughs> uh, just to make sure. Uh, but, yes, it is. Okay. It's still so hard. Okay, now I'm ready. <laughs> Sorry. I feel so silly looking at the camera sometimes. We're not on kick. YouTube frogs, we are not on kick. Dude, imagine I had a kick deal. How much would... Like, would you guys cancel me for that? If they offered me, like, 10 milli, would you guys be like, oh, we're done with PC? And let's be honest, if I streamed on kick, if I streamed on kick, I'd probably have more viewers, because everybody bots over there. Look at my viewer count. Don't say it. Wait, I just looked. <laughs> it would cost your dignity. I feel like streaming is already a lack of dignity. You live in a mansion and hang out with Kai Senna. That would be cool. But I think I would be scared of, like, the fireworks stream. Didn't, wait, didn't Kai just, like, move? I don't know. I, I only see, like, the titles of Kai's streams. And then I draw my own conclusions. Oh, also, I did my nails this morning. Blue? I was cooking. Blue? Because I'm a Democrat. No, just kidding. I'm an independent. I'm a socialist. Okay. I'm deleting that. I don't want that on screen. <laughs> What the fuck? What? <laughs> I was gonna do red and blue, and then I was going to make the joke about, oh my god, look, the 3D glasses from, like, the thousands. But then I didn't want to walk around with blue and red nails. I don't want people to think I'm a centrist. Okay, anyway. Guys, let's hide chat. Oh, shit. How do I clear the chat? I don't want this in the YouTube video. Wait, it's still there! <laughs> okay. Now we'll do our intro. We'll do our intro now. Guys, say hi, YouTube. Please. 
<laughs> please. <laughs> please, I'm begging. I was about to say your nails are poppins. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I can't. I can't. Okay. I love and hate recording shit live. I should just record my intros offline like everybody else. And then make it sound fake as shit. Wait, I swore. Okay. I'm sure we all remember the Will You Press the Button game from the early 2000s, maybe 20 twins, I don't know. 20 twins? Fuck! <laughs> 20 twins? <laughs> okay. I think we all remember the Will You Press the Button game from the early 2000s, maybe 2010s, that's when I started watching YouTube personally. And I have never played this game, even though I do answer hypothetical questions all the time on stream. So today, we're going to be playing Will You Press the Button. Add bloopers to the end of your videos? I've considered, but having too much, like, dead air at the end of your YouTube video is kind of bad. Because if YouTube sees that people clicked off your video, like, a minute before it's over, then they recommend it less. Oh! Oh! Wait, look at this. Oh, that's so weird. Wait, oh my god, editor, cut this out. Okay, so you know how I told chat, like, last week that my goal for the year was to lose 40 pounds? And I said, I'm almost halfway there. Chat, I was wrong. My year, or my goal for the year, because we did it on stream, so I watched that video yesterday. And my goal for the year was to lose 20 pounds. Now, I'm not going to say my weight. We'll see it when we, I mean, during the cycle of subathon in September. But let me just say, I've lost 15 pounds already. So, like, I'm almost at my goal for the year. And it's only July. Oh, my God. Just move to the UK and lose pounds every day. Wait, you're so real for that? Yeah, so like, yesterday morning I was watching that clip, I was like, oh my god! I'm actually gonna do one of my resolutions. Okay, now let's finish, let's finish the intro. I think that was it. There's no other intro. Let's begin. I don't, I don't even remember. Okay, so, I'm not gonna be doing polls for every single question, because I feel like that's gonna get fucking annoying. So, if you will press the button, just type PRESS in all caps, and it- and if you don't want to press the button, just put, like, don't press. Like, just type in chat. I think that's easier for viewers to, like, see. Button time. Okay. So many Mario songs in this comp. This is a new compilation. It's called Nostalgic Nintendo Music for When You've Had a Rough Day. Wait, that was, like, me all last week. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Now we shall begin. <clears throat> yeah, this is the right time. Okay. Will you press the button? You will get an Apple product you wish at no cost, but Microsoft will never let you play Xbox. No, not my Xbox that I totally don't have because I'm a PlayStation 4 and 5 that is my sister's and not mine. And literally have never touched an Xbox controller. Oh no! Isn't, like, Apple products so expensive? You might as well just load up on the Apple product. The only Apple products I had was my MacBook Pro that I traded in to get a camera recently. And then I have an iPad. And I literally haven't touched my iPad in, no joke, six months. So, but then I also don't have an Xbox. There's so many different consoles you can play on. And, like, PC gaming is, like, kind of slay. So, any Apple product... I kind of want one of those watches, just so I can have a heart monitor. Can you get an Apple smart house? Wait, that's a thing? I can get a whole house? I'm pressing it. I'm pressing it. 62% press the button. 38% said no. I guess 38% are gamers. Uh, type one if you're a gamer. Also, I got a an email. I'm surprised, genuinely, that it's 62%. I thought it would be more. Because, like, an Apple product is potentially worth more than an Xbox. Oh, wait, this website was probably made, like, years and years ago. Actually, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> okay. I forgot to grab my water cup.
An iPhone 3 or an Xbox 360? Yeah, that's probably what the question was asking at the time. But like the Xbox, I'll say it never was cool. Next question. Will you press the button? You win a 5 million lottery. Wait, that is so dated. Isn't the lottery like a billion dollars now? It's not a billion. It's like 10 million or 100 million. But the troll song plays in the background and only you can hear it for four random hours every day. $5 million lottery, income tax is probably going to take, what, like $4 million of that? No, it won't be that much. <laughs> but you would hear the troll song for four hours every day. Is it, like, just in your head? Kind of like if you have a bug fly in your ear, you just hear it in your ears? That actually happened to my sister. There was, like, a fly that flew in her ear, and it was there for a few days. She had to go to the doctor's office. I don't know if I can handle that every day, though. Uh, I'm not gonna press it. You know, I already hear things sometimes, and I do not want to hear the song for four hours a day. Six, or sorry, 58% yes, 42% no. I'm part of the minority, which is fitting. Next question. Will you press the button? You can press the button and know the truth. But you'll wish you didn't- Wait, truth about what? About what? Oh, I mean, I feel like I already know a lot of hard truths. Like, my parents didn't tell me they loved me a lot. <laughs> yeah, I don't like this question either. It's- it's weird. Well, what truth? I want to make a joke, but like, I know the joke will get me demonetized, so I'm not gonna say it. Ignorance is bliss. That's so real and true. Now, I'm, I'm trying to think of truth that, like, I really want to know. I, it's hard because, like, I'm a very honest and transparent person for the most part. And I also know how to, like, get information out of somebody. You know, I'm a ghastly gatekeep girl boss. There's nothing that, like, I want to know. I'm not gonna press it. Because I feel like there's probably, like, a truth, like, hidden deep inside. That, like, I haven't, like, tapped into yet. Okay, we're deleting that chat message, mods. Mods. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Next question. Will you press the button? You will be given immortality, but you will have almost nothing. You'll have immortality, meaning you don't die, but you'll have almost nothing. Okay, with the American mentality of lifting myself up by my bootstraps, I could, like, get anything I need to, right? But, like, I don't know if I want to live forever. Like, if anybody asks, like, do you want to live forever? My answer is usually no. Because it's like, if I live forever and then everybody else doesn't, like, they're all going to die. And, like, not to be sad, but, like, my friends and the family that I do have mean a lot to me. And then, if I live forever, I'm going to have to keep losing and keep making friends and then losing them and then making more friends. Like, yeah, I would have, like, a million friends on Facebook. Because I would live forever. But I don't want that. Girl, I'm barely enjoying the 80 years I have here. Wait, that's so real. Um, Even if it said you would have nothing. Or if you had everything. And you still had an immortality. I don't think I would press it still. I don't want to live forever. 37 pressed the button and 63% didn't. What if you're immortal, but you forgot everything every 100 years? Wait, that actually would be kind of cool. But then you would, I assume, does your body get older? Like, if you live to a thousand, is your body, like, do you, I don't think you stay young forever. That's what people assume when they think immortality, but I don't, I don't think so. That ain't right. Also, I forgot to say this at the start of stream. Uh, guys. 
Where is it? Where is it? Today's stream is presented to you by, oh my god, Beast and Art on myshopify.com. New prints were launched last Friday. So guys, if you want to support the stream, buy some artwork, you know, they're cheaper. Or if you like the paintings, you can purchase a painting and I'll paint it on stream for you. Also, just a reminder, if you are a current Twitch subscriber on my channel, you get an exclusive $17 discount. Ain't no way. So guys, click the link. Go bookmark the website too. Okay, now back to our our main show. I forgot to plug at the start. I'm gonna name my daughter Peason underscore seventeen after my favorite artist. No, but like imagine you actually do that. I would be so scared. Like I know it's like flattering, but <laughs> imagine Peason isn't even my real name. And if you know my real name, no, you don't. I've been lying this whole time. Um next question. Will you press the button? You would have as much money as you want, but every day you would have to suffer painful procedures. So it's saying every day you have money, but like you're disabled. Which is pe some people's reality, which could be my reality. But like, I, I'm not immunocompromised, so I don't need like daily medicine or anything. As much money as I want. See, the problem is, I don't want a million dollars. Like, that would be cool. But I don't want that. I would want, like, maybe... Maybe 750k. That way my, I'm not, like... Too rich? Because if I'm too rich, people will try to, like, leech. And I don't like leeches. See, I, I don't like this question because it's like asking, do you want to be disabled? And that's kind of like a, a moral question I don't like. I don't know. Does getting wax count as a painful procedure? I guess it could. They didn't really specify what the procedure is. If it is waxing or like plucking. Um, how do I say this? You know, I've I've done both, just not every day. And like they're fairly tolerable. I imagine they're talking about like needles and stuff. Which I used to donate plasma twice a week, and those weren't too bad. Uh, see, the, the thing is, like, I very much value my time, and I feel like the procedures would take time out of my day. I'm going to say I will not. 27% yes, 73% no. Makes sense. Didn't you faint? I got very close to fainting the first time I donated plasma, but that's because I went... To donate i don't think i drank enough water like i was still within the uh, hydration requirement level but like i went immediately from inside the super cold ac building to outside in like 90 degree weather to take the bus home and as i was waiting for the bus i almost fainted because like i think i had like brief heat stroke <laughs> so otherwise like it was fine also i told jen i had a blood clot like a month ago I'm off my meds as of a week and a half now, and my doctor said I can donate again. W. Guys, donate blood, donate plasma when you can to help the immunocompromised and those in the ER. Donate blood. Yep, no more thin blood. I can't even, because it was weird. You can't see it on camera, but like, for the entire last month, you could see all the veins in my hands, and look, you can't see them no more. Also, hi, Electra. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Yeah, no more thin blood. Okay, back to it. Editor, cut this out. Next question. Will you press the button? You can run as fast as the flash, but you can... You can run as fast as the flash, but you can never walk. You have to run. So 
So every single time you move around, you have to go super quick. I don't know if I'd like that. Because, <laughs> like, even just, like, walking across my room, I would have, like, my cup in hand, and then, like, I'd go zooming, and the water would spill. It would be, like, it would sound really practical. Like, if I had to get across the ocean, I could just walk on the ocean. I mean, run on the ocean. But, like, just getting around, like, short distances... I feel like it'd be more annoying. Imagine getting married and literally running down the aisle. <laughs> that would be really funny. Personally, I think there's more practicality to walking. Oh, wait, I've also... um, This is, like, anecdotal something that I heard. But for those people who have, like... um Exercise setups at, like, their work desk, so that way they can, like, either walk or run, or, like, move their hips when they're working, whenever you're doing, like, a longer shift, or you're doing, like, chores on your computer, it can be an issue for your long-term, like, joint health, because you're supposed to let your body rest. That's why they recommend you exercise for, like, four to five times a week for, like, an hour or two maximum, because if your body is moving too much, you're not giving your, your muscles time to rest. So if you're going to be, like, walking on your treadmill for four hours when you're working, you're activating it too much. You're going to wear them out quicker. Will you give me the honor of running down the aisle with you? Sorry, I got a sugar mama. They called dibs. For practical reasons, I will not push the button. 40% yes and 60% no. Okay. Okay. I run everywhere anyway. That is true. Hi, Cutie Lee. Can we get some yo's? Hello. I don't... Yeah, I still wouldn't want to run super fast. Next question. Will you press the button? You become very attractive. But you have a really high-pitched voice. Wait, that's like me already. Right, type one of you agree. <laughs> we should pull the chat. I thought about doing that, Ethan, but like it would take too much time. And like I don't want to pay my mods overtime. Become Mariah Carey? I mean, I did just sing her song earlier. <laughs> Pride month is over. You can't make jokes like that anymore. <laughs> also, I'm sad. I didn't see a single one in chat. That means you guys are not simps. Thank you. <laughs> Also, guys, we are 30 minutes in the stream, so if we do her, click that follow button. You get cool emotes, and you get to jump in chat. Isn't that cool? I think this is only detrimental if you're a manly man. I guess. There's not many guys I know who have high-pitched voices. But I know for me, like, the, the voice I use on stream isn't my real voice. Like, everything I do on camera is a character. I am the community. Do you even have LGBTQIA tagged? Wait, cutie Lee. <laughs> I was gonna ask you this later. I just saw your Instagram post. It has to be a joke. You have to put slash S. That way people know it's a joke. <laughs> or maybe it's not a joke. I don't know. Anyway. I'm not going to press the button because I already think I'm pretty cute and I have a sugar mama. 45% yes, 55% no. If you click the button, I'm sorry you're insecure. Next question. Will you press the button? Firefly will come back on the air for 20 seasons, but your current favorite show will be canceled, killing off all of your favorite characters. I don't even know what Firefly is. Easy question. No, 77% no. <laughs> Have you seen Grown Ups 2? No. <laughs> yeah, I haven't seen Firefly either. I feel like it, it was probably a hit when this came out, but... <laughs> okay. Okay, I don't like this music compilation. It's too soft.
removing that one from the playlist L song. Okay. <clears throat> Next question. Will you press the button? You can shape shift into anything or anyone at any time and back. That's actually huge. But your clothes you are wearing all disintegrate, leaving you naked as whatever you transform into. That's like how most shapeshifters work, like in sci fi, right? But, like, why would I need to shapeshift? Whenever people ask, what's your favorite superhero power? Like, I never say shapeshifting. Because, like, what, what's the video point? Before you in stream. <laughs> Hi, cutie Lee. Thank you for the resub. 15 months? Holy shit. Live react to my video before you end stream? Um, I charge $100 per react. I take it via Cash App, which is in my profile. But thank you, cutie Lee. <laughs> Sorry, I can't. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> guys i took an asd test on stream and my sister says i probably am autistic so i'm allowed to laugh at that <laughs> shapeshift into a millionaire and steal from them they won't even notice wait huge that could be a banger idea wait just shapeshift into a frog and never turn back that's literally the plot of the Disney movie Princess and the Frog, which I loved. I think Tiana was very cute. I'm not gonna press the button because like I don't I generally don't see me using shape shifting. And wait, I'm not gonna say this. <laughs> I'm not saying it. <laughs> Ethan. <laughs> I saw it before you deleted it. I saw it. That's my favorite Disney princess movie. The first ever movie I saw in theaters was The Princess Frog. Or maybe it was Tangled. No, it was Princess Frog and then I saw Tangled in 3D and that was my first 3D movie. You guys realize every time you use the peace out command, it marks on your record as a timeout. Like, you're giving yourself a timeout. That's going to show up on your Christmas review stream. You're going to go on the naughty list. Okay, next question. Will you press the button? You can control the mind of anyone you want, which I kind of already do because I'm a ghastly GameCube girl boss. But you can only use this power for one hour a day. And once they come free of your control, they remember everything and hate you for it. Oh, that's actually really bad. Because oh, they're going to remember, like, all the bad shit I did. I'm, like, I'm trying to think of, like, how I would use this. I don't think I would use this power on anybody I knew. I think what I honestly would do, like, if I'm at the shop, I would mind control the person at the register and make them, like, void out all my transactions or override everything to make it zero. Like, do a little bit of fraud, hypothetically. Because, like, the cashier doesn't know me. They're not going to remember me. Yeah, I might be on the cameras, but then it would be the cashier's fault. Because it was them typing on the computer, not me. Otherwise, I don't see how I would use this. Oh, wait, I, you could also use this against, like, a bank teller. Just have them, like, accidentally transfer you, like, $1,000. Use criminals and then toss them off the cliff? I'm just reading out the chat. That is not my opinion. I caught that. You've got to be faster at typing, too, if you're going to make jokes like that. <laughs> okay. If I do press the button, I'm not going to use this on anybody I know. It would just be complete strangers. Ooh, more even. 52% yes, 48% no. Okay. I, I stand behind what I said. Like, that, I think that's the only w reason why I would use it. It's not like you would have to use the power, but just press it in case. Exactly. Exactly. Next question. Will you press the button? You will get a non-fading perfect dream tattoo. I thought that was going to say a low taper fade. <laughs> but it will hurt a thousand times more than usual. 
I've never gotten a tattoo. I literally have no interest in getting a tattoo. And I'll say it, I think it's kind of cool when tattoos fade. I know they're not as crisp or clean, but I think it's it's interesting to me. And if it hurts a thousand times more than usual... Wait, okay. If you get a tattoo, are you allowed to like take an ibuprofen? Because I know you can't get a tattoo if you're on blood thinners. And like ibuprofen is a temporary blood thinner. Can... Are you allowed to? I don't know. Either way, like, I like how tattoos fade. I think it's cool. I will not press the button. 83% no? They're wimps. Next question. Okay, this is a long one. Will you press the button? The perfect partner now lives with you. You both are extremely affectionate towards each other, and you are both extremely honest and trustful, and you are both willing to work hard to make the relationship work. Can't you just, like, make this happen in your real life? Like, you, you don't have to wish this into fruition. You just gotta, like, date around and, like, see what works. Anyway. But your parents do not approve of this person, and no matter what they do, they never will. They will never attempt to stop it, but will only criticize and insult you for it. Wait, that's, like, literally my reality. In the past. I'm single now, but I do have a sugar mama. Isn't this just regular queer dating? No, that's so real. I don't, I don't, I don't know, like, this is just, you can make this a reality yourself. You don't have to, like, push the button and will it into reality. Th this is fine. I I'm not pressing it because, like, I can literally just make this happen. Uh, what? 71% yes, 29% no. If you push the button, you're lonely. I'm sorry, you're lonely. I already have that and my parents don't approve because he's a man. I'm sorry. But, you know, as long as you're happy and healthy, I'm sure they'll come around to it. People who pressed yes have had it happen to them already. Oh, then I should have pressed yes. Anyway, next question. Will you press the button? You can resell and buy used game on Steam. Okay, that's kind of huge. But no Steam sales ever again. Not even daily deals. I guess the practicality of, like, reselling a digital game is, like, unrealistic. But, like, no more sales! No more deals! No! No, legit, the only time I will buy a game is if it's on sale. Because what I'll do is I'll add a bunch of games to my wish list on Steam and Nintendo. And I refuse to buy any game at full price. Unless, like, I genuinely really want to play it on, like, opening weekend. But otherwise, I will only buy stuff on sale. I gotta sneeze. Don't look. Close your eyes. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. But I guess if you can buy used games on Steam, they would be a discounted price. I don't know. I personally will try to buy used games if it's like an in-person or... <laughs> I would personally try to buy used games for, like, older consoles. I don't mind buying, like, newer physical games, like, for Switch. I would be really sad if there was no more sales. So I will not push the button. I'm a sucker for a sale or coupon. 35% yes, 65% no. You know, everybody who did not push the button were thinking practically. Because even if they sell used games... Oh, wait, maybe the price of a used game would be less than if it were on sale. I don't know. Next question. Will you press the button? You will be able to live 100 years longer, but you don't get any jokes and will never laugh again. Wait, that's just, like, literally the ASD experience. <laughs> wait, that's, like, so real. <laughs> wait, but never laughing again? Aww. That would be really sad. My streams would be so sad. I laugh a lot. Like, for fake laughs, and then also because, like, something is funny. And a hundred years longer? If I live a hundred years longer, I would be, like, 180. I don't think your body would keep up for that long. You would be, like, in agony for the additional hundred years. 
These questions all assume that we aren't depressed to begin with. Wait, that's so real. That's so real. It says you'll be able to live. Wait, you're right. It's not guaranteed that you will live 100 years extra. I'm not pushing the button. I would be very sad, like, if I couldn't laugh. Not to be, like, super sad, but, like, very little things give me joy. I've been diagnosed with depression for two years. And, like, not getting to laugh and not understanding jokes, I feel like that would be more frustrating than anything. Next question. Will you press the button? You'll be able to excel and be incredibly successful in any art form you want. Music, film, YouTube videos. Wait, YouTube! I want that. I want to get monetized. But you'll be universally disliked and all your fans will be horrible and annoying. No! That's just every creator I know, but like... You got you guys like me, right? You guys aren't all hate watchers, right? Oh no. I do feel whenever you do like online content like Tic Tac, YouTube, there is a point where a majority of your viewers will like you, but there will always be a small sector of those who do not like you and those who watch you because they genuinely don't like what you do. But those people just don't have a life, and that's whatever. You shouldn't listen to those people. But all of your fans will be horrible, annoying. Let's be honest. That's like a Kai Sinet chat. <laughs> it's so hard to read his chat. Ah. <laughs> uh. I hate comment on streamers I like. Wait, does that mean you like my stream? You could be like Jojo Siwa. Oh no. Oh no. You know what? I think I can succeed without people hating me and me doing obnoxious things. I will not push the button. Guys, click the like button and subscribe right now. Wait, I forgot to do this. This was... I forgot to do this at the... At the start of stream. Editor, um, splice this and put this at the very start. <laughs> okay. This video was streamed live over on twitch.tv slash peace and underscore 17. So make sure you're following me over there. Let's go ahead and jump into it. Okay, that was literally what I was supposed to record earlier and I forgot. Editor, you know what to do. Okay. <laughs> I like Jojo Shiwa. She's just overhated. I think I think Jojo's okay. But like as with anybody who's grown up in media and entertainment for basically the entire life, like I feel like they should be forgiven a bit more. Next question. Will you press the button? You successfully find a way to cure world hunger by natural means, but you are no longer able to digest any food. Another, do you want to do this thing, but then you become a disabled question. This is so ableist in 2024. How dare they? If I cure world hunger, then I'm the good guy. Like, I'm a hero. But you're no longer able to digest any food. Oh well. I'll I'll just have I'll just I'll just have like the tube and shit. But let's be honest. You know, governments could cure world hunger now. Take one for the team, that's what I'm saying. No, but wouldn't this be like a crazy Mr. Beast video? I starved myself so the entire world could not go hungry anymore. I'm clicking it. I'm clicking it! We need that thumbnail. 46% yes, 54% no. I want to say that the 54% is selfish. But, you know. You know. You know. Next question. Will you press the button? You invent a time machine, but every time you use it, you get smacked in the face by every historical figure. <laughs> every historical figure uh depending on what state you live in there's a lot of historical figures that people don't learn about so even if i just had to use the time machine once i'll just take the hit i'll like put some lotion on my face maybe have a tin of powder that way when they do smack me it hurts a bit less
<laughs> I'm not saying that out loud. I don't want Clippers to have that material. I'm the type of person to where I try not to live with regrets. Like, yeah, there's some things I could have said or done differently, and maybe I'd be in a different place than I am now. But I literally have had no desire or even dreamed about going back in time. I fully just I fully stand behind everything I've done. So you know what? I will not push the button. I don't I don't think I would use it. 64% yes, 36% no. You can visit the dinosaurs, no historical figures there. No, I think as you're traveling through time, they would just like hit you on the way. <laughs> okay, I'm out. <laughs> I don't know if you could stop historical events. I don't know. I don't. Okay. I don't believe in fate, but I feel like things happen for a reason. And like, if you go and change an event in the past, it's probably going to affect something else in the future. Not the exact same thing will happen, but probably something bad will still happen in its place. Like, did you guys not watch or play the Life is Strange games? Like, you can't fix the past. Next question. Will you push, will you press the button? You will be able to use your mind to access all of Earth's knowledge so long as you have the right words to search with, like a human Google. But you lose all memory of your loved ones and even your own identity after pressing the button. So be a nerd. If you lose the memory of your loved ones, then it would just be like a reset, right? Because you would have all of the knowledge, just none of the social aspect in your life anymore. And if you have all the knowledge in the world, you would hypothetically read all like the Riz Lord books and videos. So you would know how to get new friend, new GF. I bet everybody in my current life would be really confused. And I'm thinking about how today is gone and I haven't pressed the button a lot. You know what? Screw it. I'm pressing the button. I'm sorry, I will forget chat, but I want to be super smart. Put my big put my big brain to use. I don't want to forget you. <laughs> don't worry, you will in like a year or two when I inevitably quit. L press. Shut up. Shut up. This is my playthrough, not yours. Word W, not an L chat room. 30% yes, 70% no. That makes sense. Next question. Will you press the button? You can read anyone's mind, but whatever they think will be in a completely different language. So even if I read the mind of somebody who only speaks English, they would think in a different language? <laughs> that would be really funny. Like... <laughs> Okay, I'm deleting that Spartan. What the fuck? Actually, Spartan, you're getting a warning for that one. Okay. Will you press the button? I don't know. What's the drawback here? You want to be able to understand what they're thinking. Because, like, the whole point of reading somebody else's mind is to understand... What they're thinking but if you can't literally understand because it's in a different language it would be pointless just learn every language easy that's what i was thinking like if we had the power from the previous one of having the eternal world knowledge then this we, we could do this we could double up What if it's a language that I know, like Spanish? I don't know. No, I don't see, I don't, I don't see the practical use behind it. 53% yes, 47% no. Pretty split. Will you press the button? Become the richest man in the world, 
but you were forced to live in Harlem and could wear nothing but uh, uh <laughs> I will not press that. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> Jesus, that is so 2010. <laughs> Oh my god, editor, cut that one out. <laughs> I don't want that on the YouTube video. Will you press the button? You will become the most successful person in the world with wealth, happiness, fame, lovers, <gasps> plural, oh my god, and untold wealth, but you can't have children. I'm pressing that button so fast, I literally never want kids. I'm saying that now, girlies, it's like not even worth it. Look up the husband stitch. What's the drawback? That is so real and true. If you can't have children, okay, that can either mean you physically can't birth, or maybe it's implying that you can't adopt either. I told myself if I ever, like, have an epiphany and, like, want kids, I would adopt. Get dogs? Oh, I would get a million cats. I would build a mansion and just have cats in it. Okay, we'll do one more, because we're almost in an hour, and I only wanted to do this for, like, 40 minutes. That way, it's, like, a 10-minute video. I forgot to clean my room for tomorrow. Don't worry, you got half the day left. Okay, the final question. Will you press the button? Start a new life, but you forgot your old one. So, like, literally a reset. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. A reset could be kind of interesting. Kind of like reincarnation, right? I mean, let's be honest. There's a lot of things I want to forget from this current timeline. <laughs> uh, hashtag trauma. <laughs> but if you, like, start a new life... That would be like a whole bunch of different experiences, right? You think you just fell out of a coconut tree? Nah. My brain is big for another reason. When it says forget your old life, does it mean like your memories or do you forget like everything you learned? Like, is it like you have dementia where you forget how to brush your teeth, too? You know what? I'm not going to press the button. I'm not necessarily super happy or content. You know, I get by. But I truly believe that your lived experiences form your personality. And forgetting everything. Yeah, you might be different, but running away from it is not good. You have to learn how to face things head on. But yeah. Well, guys, that was Will You Press the Button? How many times did you press the button? Put your comments below. I think I pressed it. I pressed it not a lot, honestly. I think I only pressed it like five times. But yeah. So guys, if you enjoyed it, click the like button and subscribe. And if you want to watch me do this live, you can follow my Twitch, twitch.tv slash peacein underscore 17. Go follow right now. But thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Okay. Is there anything else I need to say? <laughs> Will you press the button? You get to beat Sketch, but you have to stream every Pokemon game. You know what I'll say? It's Sketch is a cool guy. He seems chill. W Sketch. But every Pokemon game? We're only doing that for peace lock. I do not want to be a Pokemon streamer. Will I press the button? Yeah, why not? Why not? Okay, guys, you know the drill. We are an hour into stream. So you know what? It's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for 
$5.99, just $6. Skip your coffee and get adequate viewing all month long. Or, big or. You can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you got a free sub available. Do it now. Um, what are we going to do now? Oh, now we get to plan the subathon that we're doing on Thursday. So, guys, when you're watching the ad, I want you to think and ponder and then submit your ideas in three minutes. Okay, now mods change the title. Planning for Subathon. Peace, I too know why. What's a streamathon? Uh, I guess a streamathon would be a subathon, right? So a subathon is basically a a stream in which there's a timer on screen, and then for every donation, so subscription, donation, bit cheer, gifted sub. Sometimes people will add time to the timer if it's like a raid or whatever. I'm not doing that. I'm not. I'm sorry. Um, it'll add time to the timer. So I did make a post on my Twitter yesterday because I was like finalizing how I wanted it to go yesterday. I'm opening up my notepad app right now so we can type ideas as we talk. Oh, it's right there. W. <laughs> w. So last year we did a subathon for my two year stream anniversary. My stream anniversary is technically August 2nd, but last year we did the subathon in September. That way we could take advantage of the discounted subs during September. But this year, you know, pizza needs to go to a funeral in like two weeks. And the ticket is going to cost $600. So, Oilers, I need your support. <laughs> so, we're bumping up the stream anniversary subathon to the actual, um, what you call it, to the actual date of the anniversary, which is August 2nd. The subathon will start on Thursday, August 2nd. I should write this on stream. Do, 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 do. Okay, so it's 30. I'll put a zero. 30 hour cap starts Thursday morning. Can run till Friday afternoon. Because I got to do stuff Friday night. You know, my sugar daddy wants to hang out. And yes, I have a sugar mama and a sugar daddy. I say them interchangeably to throw you guys off. So, it'll start at 10 a.m. on Thursday. <laughs> Cat means minimum? No. <laughs> no. No. Imagine. Imagine. No. A cap means a maximum. Maximum 30 hours. So, last year... Last year... <laughs> I'm putting my hair up. I'm getting annoyed. See how frizzy it is on this side? And then, like, decent it is on this side? Did I watch AMP Cypher? No. I did watch the Creator League basketball games this weekend. Which brand of hair do I use? Like, hair product? I use... Oh, wait, that's so cute, actually. I use Loma. And then I have some leave-in conditioner. But the hair ties, I just got from my local grocery store. They don't have them anymore. I don't know what brand it is. Okay. So, last year we did a subathon. And it hit the 12-hour cap. So, I think the timer last year started at 3 hours. And then we had enough donations to where the time was extended by nine hours. So that means I got about, it was one sub equals five minutes last year. I think I got like 80 subs last year. W. Main gifter was Kobobo. W. So this year, subs are worth 10 minutes because inflation. As we know, Twitch did increase the price for gifted and tier ones. By a dollar. I was going to make one sub equal six minutes, but you know what? I haven't done a stream longer than 13 hours. Fucking, we'll do a 30 hour stream if we hit it. 
So we're gonna take a nap on stream. We'll talk about that. We'll talk about it. Um, so subs equals ten minutes. Also, I think something I want to do is for tier ones or primes, they'll be worth an extra minute. Because let's be honest, a tier one is a lot more valuable than a gifted. I wonder if Joe Biden would like Roblox just to impress. Should I play just to impress type one? Y L O LO LOL? Can you clarify, Cutie Lee? How do you know Joe doesn't play every day? Maybe that's what's causing his brain rot. I wait, I don't even have a Roblox account. I don't have it. I don't have to, nobody steal my username. I need to get peace in 17 on Roblox. Also, we did get a follower 10 minutes ago, but I didn't say thank you because it had a sus username. I hope they get banned. I have VIP on trust to impress. Of course you would. <laughs> of course you would. Okay, so the reason why subs are worth 10 minutes is because one, Twitch did the inflation, charging a dollar more for gifted and tier ones. And then also, why not make it 10 minutes? Why not? Because this year, I since it's in August, so subscriptions are still the $6 price, I'm probably not going to get as many donations. So I think realistically, I'll get 20 subs. So 20 subs, 200 minutes, about, about three hours, about three to four hours extra time added. And that's fine. I don't care. It would be insane if we did hit 30 hours. That'd be crazy because I'm starting the timer. Um, starting at three hours. So if it starts at 10, if literally no donations, it would end at one. And that's fine. I still have enough activities to fill three hours. And then bits are worth, since I have a hundred bit minimum, bits are worth 200, oops, oops 200 bits. Or 100 bits is worth two minutes that way it's like a similar ratio to the 10 minute because if a sub is six dollars we'll go from there um and another idea i had and the reason why the sub starts at 10 minute worth is for every five minutes spin wheel to change time sub is worth i think that's kind of funny because it was the first year I did a subathon, we did the power hours. So at the top of every hour before I ran an ad break, subs were worth double time. So instead of five minutes, they were worth 10. I kind of like that idea because then it would encourage people to donate during that five minute window. But I think it would be fucking funny if somebody, or every five minutes, every five subs, sorry, every five gifted, like not five total gifted, but five sub drop. It'd be really funny if like we span the wheel and then it changed the sub time worth to like one minute because the subathon overlay counter I have, you can like edit it throughout the stream. I think that'd be really fucking funny. <laughs> and then the time would stay at that changed rate until we get another five gifted. I think that would be really funny because like we can have one minute, five minute, 10 minutes. So the same. And then for funsies, 21 minutes because that's a funny number. I think that would be really funny. Oh, wait. We should have 17 because that's my favorite number, actually. Yeah, so we... What do you guys think of the wheel idea? <clears throat> okay. So that's basically all of the, like, timer rules. Now we can talk about actual activities. Can I change the font color? No, I can't. Sad. This is the notepad app. Okay, so activities. Let's add up here. Rules. Why not a wheel for stuff to do? Um, I thought about that too. But the problem is we don't have enough activities. So guys, give me your suggestions right now. So the main thing... The theme for this year's subathon, because year one was just random games. Year two was random games as well. So since this is my three-year stream anniversary, the theme is, 
overall theme, nostalgia. So that means playing old games that I used to play on stream. So that would be MK, which I still play. Um, Stardew Valley. Everybody's been begging for Stardew Valley. Oh, wait, we can actually look at my VOD channel. Draw something. We could do a drawing challenge. Here, I'll write that down. And I'll put chat ideas here. Like, drawing challenge. Because the subathon will still be in this corner of my room. We're not doing a two-camera setup. We're not moving downstairs to the kitchen, so nothing to do with cooking if possible. Um, I will still have my second camera, so like it'll have to be things restricted to my desk. Because my sister was telling me I should try and like do a cooking challenge, but like I don't want to bring my setup downstairs. It's too much. Just matches with viewers. Okay, we can maybe do that. As long as you guys aren't annoying. <laughs> Truth or square. Is that a game I'd have to buy? Stealing ideas as we speak? No! Classic cutely, no! I knew this way you watched the stream today. What the fuck? <laughs> no, but aren't you streaming like every day in August? You're gonna like die. <laughs> you got six okay, you think I have sixty dollars? Literally the subathon is so I can go see you my grandma's funeral. You think I have fucking sixty dollars? Sorry. <laughs> okay, so activities have to be like cheap. You know, we're balling on a budget, and my budget is five dollars. Because I'm gonna say it, I'm probably not gonna get my Twitch payout for July because my sub count is lower, and that's fine. But that's because the price increase that was anticipated. So I'm probably not going to. Thank you. Thank you for reminding me, Smartin. Pirate truth or square? <laughs> we need we need things that are free. I need things that are free. Oh wait, I thought you meant the game was pirate themed, not like actually stealing. I would never steal a game. Fingers not crossed. I literally just made a TikTok talking about like not pirating anymore. I'm reformed. I no I no longer rob and steal. Okay, so what other games? Oh, wait, I was looking at my VOD channel. I'm distracted. Man, there's so many good peace in videos. Guys, go sub to my YouTube. Ain't no way. Okay. All streams from 2022. Oh my god. Okay, I'm looking at what I used to do on stream. Oh yeah, I used to do art all the time. I started streaming in 2021? I forgot. Holy shit. Okay. Let's see. Holy. Okay, so my first month of streaming, August 2021, I literally did art streams. Yeah, I literally just did art streams because I didn't have my game capture card. Ooh, what if we do viewer portraits? Because I used to do ink portraits on stream. What do you guys think about that? Thoughts? Thoughts? Like, if people... Like, send pictures on Twitter or Instagram, I can, like, do full ink portraits again. Viewer... I ain't doing pets. I don't know how to draw dogs. Even if we only get, like, one person, that's still... Because, like, each portrait will take, like, an hour. Viewer ink portraits. And then... Post on Twitter. We I'll just have to make clear in that post that, like, your picture might be shown on stream. They're, like, people but dogs. Uh, draw me a picture of a dog and DM me on Instagram. Do it. I'm in her DMs. <laughs> okay, stop. Don't say it like that. You're only in my DMs because you won the art giveaway. Can't draw? Then stop talking. Whoa, my first ever gaming stream was September 1st, 2021. Oh my god, nobody was watching me. 
back when I was streaming in 2021 because I only really had like viewers that weren't friends. Um, in 2022, like I had a super shitty mic and it would cut out and like go all the time. Man, those were the good old days when nobody was watching. I didn't have to worry about being perceived. React to our songs? We can maybe do that, like, near the end of the day. Um, wait, I don't, wait, I don't know if I want to do that for the long stream, Ethan. Like, I still want to do that, like, reacting to viewers' suggested songs. But the problem is, even if I remove the audio track from the VOD, I can still get, like, the stream, like, claimed. And, like, it would fucking suck. To have a like longer stream like removed off of Twitch entirely. We're we're gonna have to we'll do that another day for sure, for sure on God on God. Okay, let's see. I did Mario Kart drawing Mario Kart Mario Kart. I played a lot of Mario Kart. Oh my God, Super Mario Odyssey. I also played that when I first started streaming. That's when I had like my first few chatters. Wait, why, why, why? I hear my voice. Oh, it's... <laughs> Sorry. I accidentally played a video. Yeah, don't risk it. Okay, I'm glad you understand. Because, like, I'm, I'm fine with, like, losing a one-hour VOD, but, like, I, I, it would fucking suck if I lost, like, a six-plus-hour subathon. Because, like, even if you remove background audio from your Twitch VOD track, if Twitch really, like, fucking didn't like you, they could just take down your whole stream. It's kind of like when people were streaming the Olympics a few years ago, like, Twitch will just, like, clap you. And I don't want any strikes. You know, we've been streaming for three years. I can't lose this. <laughs> okay, so Super Mario Odyssey. We could be Odyssey in one sitting. Oh, I also started Stardew Valley in September. It kind of sucks because the moment I started gaming streams, I just stopped doing art. And, like, it didn't really matter because, like, I had no fucking viewers anyway. But... Oh yeah, I did Garden Story. I think I want to... I never finished Garden Story, which is kind of like the... Um, Turnip Boy does tax evasion. But I never finished it, so I think we'll just replay that later in August. <laughs> Twitch banned me once because I put my date of birth as 2022. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> Good one. But don't say your actual birthday, don't. That is hilarious. Oh yeah, so like the only games, the only games that I really played when I first started streaming was Odyssey, Stardew Valley, and Mario Kart. There's no, there's literally no other games for that four month period. That's kind of sad. My birthday is June fifteenth. Oh, we just missed it. Pokemon. Wait, I really want to play Poco Rogue. Okay, I have to be peace off this week. I have so many different, like, random stream ideas for, like, one-off streams that can become edits, but I don't want to do those during the subathon. Draw Pokemon from memory? I already did that video. It's on my YouTube channel. Guess Pokemon? We can, but we can probably do, how you say, Pictionary? The only problem with playing Pictionary is I need viewers. Like, it's awkward <laughs> if you do a Pictionary on stream and then you have, like, one chatter. It's, like, really awkward. I just realized I have a birthday of a year. No way! Watch Coco Melon. Is Coco Melon copyrighted? Because, like, even if shit is on YouTube, it still can be claimed. Wait, Animal Crossing. Do I really want to do Animal Crossing on stream, though? I'm not a cozy streamer anymore. And when I say cozy streamer, I mean boring streamer. Type 1 if you agree. That I'm not boring. <laughs> Just dance stream? I am not showing my ass on camera. People born in December have to wait a whole year for their birthday. My sister's birthday in December. And it's right by Christmas. So she always got doubled up on gifts. She didn't... All her birthday gifts and Christmas gifts would be combined. Hot tub stream? Ethan, you're getting a... I almost said ban. I deleted that one. I don't want that in the YouTube video. Karaoke? Um... I would love to do a karaoke IRL one day. 
But then I'd have to take my mask off. Fuck it, mask on. Okay, I'm still looking through all the old games I played. Oh my god, my first just chatting stream. February 14th, 2022. Oh my god. Yeah, there's no other games. I think... Let's see. I'll close this out. I was there. You were not. Ethan, you started following. Where are you? April 23rd. Oh my god, a day before my birthday. Do a face reveal? No, it's just like, I want to be woke and like, I don't want to not wear a mask in public. How about subs can submit a song and then you put them on a wheel and then you sing the winner. Oh wait, song requests? Oh, you guys are gonna lose your mind. Okay, be honest. If we did that, like, if you donate to suggest a song, would you donate? But, like, it can't be a dirty song. We can maybe do this. Maybe. But then you guys are gonna suggest a walk, and I'm not gonna sing walk. There goes all my songs. See? Clocked you. I would, but I can't. Yeah. Yeah, you know, this is a NA friendly stream. Okay, so right now, to review activities that I have. Overall theme is nostalgia. Playing old games that I used to play, which were Mario Kart, Stardew Valley, and. Oh, oh I didn't finish spelling Odyssey. Viewer Ink Portraits post on Twitter. I would have to make the post on Wednesday. Chat ideas. Drawing challenge. Chess. Dress to impress. Pictionary. Donator. Suggest song to sing. Okay. So, still be thinking about ideas. We'll come back to it. So, sleeping time. Now, I'm sorry, simps. I will not sleep on stream. I'm sorry. It's not that, like, how do I say this? <laughs> I get very, like, hot at night, so some things, like, accidentally fall off. So, yeah, I cannot sleep on camera. <laughs> Somebody got automated. Okay, I'm allowing that. I'm allowing that just so you guys can see what it was. <laughs> huh? Huh? I'm glad I farmed at least one, huh? Marbles or words during sleep? Okay, you know what? I'll say this. I'll say this. I think it's boring as shit whenever people have, like, the activities. Whenever they're, like, doing a sleeping stream. I get why, like, you're trying to farm chat engagement during, like, a low part of the stream, like, when you're sleeping. But the plan is simple. Play YouTube videos. But, like, my own. Because I was going to make, like, a simple overlay. Is there a pen tool? Open it. I'm trying to see if there's a pen tool. Oh, there is no pen tool. Sad. Okay. So I was going to make an overlay where it was a black screen, top text, <laughs> bottom text videos playing in box like you know the meme and then we're gonna call it pnn peace and oh not news network i didn't like that joke actually and then we'll just have like chat on screen it would it'll just be like an offline chat basically but like still streaming pbs peace in Peace in broadcast. What would the S be then? Peace in broadcast. Oh, system. 
Oh yeah, oh yeah, it, that, that's cute. I like that. PBS. I like that. You think it's one brownie point? Okay, chat on screen. Yeah, it, it'll just be... It's just gonna be the video on screen, basically. <laughs> this sounds like scam website. <laughs> Okay, so, and how it will work, which could be a detriment to me, is timer will not be paused when sleeping. I'll say this. If you pause your timer when you're sleeping, you're farming. I'll say this. The timer will not be paused. But I will set a timer... To when stream timer will end so like let's say i go to bed at 10 p.m and it says there's two hours left on the timer then i will set a timer for two hours and then i'll wake up check the stream and if it's over we say goodbye and if it's still ongoing i'll set another timer so if you guys genuinely really want to fuck with me you can just keep pushing the timer by like 30 minutes at night time <laughs> so yeah <laughs> That's the plan. Yeah, for the Naughty or Nice stream, I can see all of your logs, even the auto modded messages, the ones that get deleted. I can still see them. Donate to release Peace Lock Pokemon. No, we're gonna beat Peace Lock before the stream. We're gonna beat it before Thursday. Goes to sleep with 14 hours left, wakes up with 20. That would be crazy. I don't think you guys can do it, though. We've never done an overnight stream. And no, like I said, I will not, street, I will not sleep on stream. Because my bed is, like, over there. It's over there. We're not getting a bed cam. I thought you couldn't see Automon messages. I lied. I can still see them. I just don't acknowledge them. The only ones that, like, I will never see is if somebody, like, says a slur. Because that, that one, like, Twitch just auto-deletes. Try food that you've never tried before. I've had takoyaki before. They had it at, like, a local restaurant. It was pretty good. Remember, my budget is, like, $10 for this stream. Wait, chat orders me a pizza. We can do that. We did that last year. Chat orders pizza. Wait, what is a pizza chain that's, like, not being boycotted right now? Classic mod pizza. Is mod, like, good? Only with pineapple? I honestly would love that. I'm glad you can't see slurs, yeah. In order for somebody to, like, um... <laughs> that's good for me? Stop! <laughs> you're on thin ice. I'm not even kidding. You have one more infraction, and then you're getting per mud spartan. I'm not even fucking kidding. Okay, what else do you guys want to do? What's in the box? I have been thinking about doing a video of that style. But like, what would I do? And I'd also have to have somebody help me. Hire the reptile guy to put a snake in? <laughs> what type of snake, huh? Huh? <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. How can we do what's in the box? Oh. Yeah, my sister would have to help me. But she has to work most of that day. She's only free on the Friday.
Dude, I can't wait to like wait, somebody else got automated. Dude. <laughs> Okay, this one's allowed. I'm talking to somebody on my Twitter feed. <laughs> Dude, how can you get your Twitter mixed up with the piece in chat room? How? Frank, call your sister and tell her you sold the Switch. Oh my gosh, you would be so mad. <laughs> <laughs> she okay she never wants her voice leaked at this point my sister said she's fine with like making a vtuber at some point but she doesn't want to leak her voice until then that would be a really fun i'm writing that down that would be really funny so whenever she does make her vtuber we can do that frank call to say sold switch. We'll save that one for a rainy day. That's actually really funny. So the switch is yours and the PS5 is hers, basically. Because she kind of gave me her old switch because she got an old lead, I think, two years ago. But, like, her old switch just stays in my room all the time because I use it more often. I'm looking through my list of stream ideas for a rainy day to see if we can do any on Thursday. <gasps> we can continue the Lucia run! A Souls game? No, that would take longer than 30 hours. Depending on how I feel, we can continually see a run. Because, let's be honest, I probably won't beat her. I don't have the- is Sims free to play? All I know is that like, if you bought all the skins, it costs like 20k. Okay. I was saving the stream for a runny day. All 40 Mario Kart tracks, 200cc, I reset if I don't get first. This was my first ever YouTube video. But every single five gifted is a reset. I was going to save that stream for like a random day. But if we did that stream where five gifted equals reset, we can farm. Ooh. Maybe we can do that, because the whole run would take me three hours. We can do that at the very start of the stream. Reset if I don't get first. That way we farm donos at the start. Five gifted equals reset. The Sims 4 is free, really? Shit. Wait, let, let me see on Steam. Okay, we can maybe do that. Maybe. But then you guys would have to submit pictures, too. Because I think I for sure, I still want to do viewer ink portraits, because that's what I did three years ago, and I feel like that's a good homage. I think doing another making viewers into this stream or doing making my viewers into this in the same stream is like overhashed. But I wrote I will write down make viewers in Sims in my streams for a rainy day. Sorry, right, some of my ideas are really silly. But you know what could be fun? Drawing in Microsoft Paint. 
Because I know Microsoft Paint is more advanced now, but I'll see if I can download like older versions. And we could do like drawing the same image for 10 minutes each in different versions of Microsoft Paint if I can find older versions. That was like a stream I was saving for any day, but I feel like we can do that for the subathon. Depending on like, because each activity will take like an hour or two, depending on what it is. So, yeah. I think what we'll have to do is we'll have to make a list of like the top five things we for sure want to do. That way, if the stream only goes for eight hours, we for sure do those five things. And then things that like have less party we will do later. React to Cypher? No, we don't want drama. Okay, so we're, we're going to brainstorm for like another 5-10 minutes. So guys, I want you to keep thinking of things you want to see me do. And then also for each viewer who's in chat right now, I want you to put the thing you're most excited that you for sure wanted to see me do on Thursday. Because the timer starts at 3 hours. So the stream could end at 3 hours if we have no donos. That could happen chain together with who with who do i know how to play any instruments uh does the recorder count otherwise no play with me sketch oh my god a sketch club would be crazy you know i kept on getting comments on my youtube for a little while saying that i should collab with queso and i was like wait queso is actually really funny and then i realized they were calling me fat anyway just to review what we have on our list now Subathon is this Thursday. 30 hour cap timer starts at three hours. So it can either end at three hours or it can run until Friday afternoon at the 30 hour cap, which would be. It would end at 4 p.m. at the latest. At the latest. I think Case is really funny, and I didn't realize this, but he never swears in his streams. He's really like PG for the most part. So for donations, subscriptions equals 10 minutes, so that can be gifted or tier, or yeah, gifted or worth 10. Tier 1s and Prime subs made that day are worth an extra minute. Bits, 100 bits equals 2 minutes, because my bit share minimum on this channel is 100. I don't want people giving me pennies. Because, let's be honest, if you're donating pennies to a streamer, you don't... How, no. I was going to say you don't care, but like you probably are just like tossing people money just for it. Like, if you're going to donate, I genuinely want you to. And I feel like a dollar is significant enough. So my top two are dressed to impress. Okay, so chat, top picks. Dress to impress. And for the people who are in chat now, you guys can say the same thing, which are your top activity. It would just, like, reemphasize and then... It would just reemphasize that multiple people for sure want to see me see me do something okay so chat topics for now just to impress and draw viewers okay going back to it 100 bits is worth two minutes every five gifted single drop of five gifted is a wheel spin in which the time in which a sub of the worth is changed from either 1 5 10 17 or 21 minutes so i did the math and in order for us to hit us me whatever for us to hit the 30 hour cap, it would take 180 subs, and that's only if it was just gifted. Anyway, but if we have the wheel spin and it hits 21 minutes, <laughs> the gifted do not have to be from the same person. For the wheel spin, it would have to be five gifted from an individual. How many automotive messages do I get before I get a warning? Um, it should just tell you. <laughs> okay i'm gonna read out what tooth said i'm not gonna allow it because i don't want a word on stream tooth said imagine being a stripper and getting tossed pennies yeah exactly like i not saying that that's <laughs> not that that's not what i am but like I, if you're gonna give me money i want it to be like a decent amount <laughs> plus like pennies would hurt and not like i would know what dollar bills feel like anyway yeah, so the wheel spin 
which we will make very clear during the stream, only spin the wheel if it's five gifted from an individual person. So if somebody gives four subs, no wheel spin. If somebody gives six subs, no wheel spin. Five subs, wheel spin. Okay, activities that I came up with. Playing old games, which is Mario Kart, Stardew Valley, and Super Mario Odyssey in one sitting parenthesis. Viewer Ink Portraits. Make a post on Twitter. Continue the Lucille run, which I don't want to do. And then Mario Kart Reset if I don't get first run. Five gifted from a viewer equals a recent. And then drawing an MS Paint. I tried to clip. I don't know how. You gotta do it on mobile or desktop. You gotta hover your cursor or tap the player. And then there's a, a little clacker icon. I said clacker. Clap. No, that's not, that's not the right word. <laughs> like click clack on a T. On a. On a. I keep on saying T sounds. I think it's a new tick. T for tick. Thank you for redeeming, Spartan. We'll do that at the end of the stream. And then drawing in different versions of MS Paint. If I can't find the versions within the next few days, I'll, like, figure out how to, like, do some pi- I mean, do some arguing and then, like, find old versions. And then ideas that chat came up with. Drawing challenge. Figure out what the challenge is. Chess with viewers. Dress to impress. Pictionary. Donators suggest a song to sing. And then chat orders pizza. Mod pizza. This will have to be like a, a dono goal. Do I have virtual pads? Yeah, I have drawing tablets. Bye, Spartan. We'll see you later. And then sleeping time. So if the stream starts at 10, I should go to bed by 10. I should. But I'll be honest, I don't think we're hitting 12 hours. If we do, that'll be crazy. Okay, just to reemphasize, I will not sleep on stream on camera. It'll just be YouTube videos playing. I'll have an overlay. It'll be simple, but like kind of funny. And the timer will not be paused when I'm sleeping. So it will not be paused. Will I take a lunch break? Probably, yeah. We'll do like YouTube time when I eat as usual. I'll just have to prep all my meals the day before, which is what I usually do anyway. Okay, so now that I've gone over all the activities that we came up with today, and I'll think of other ideas over the upcoming days as well. And if you think of anything else offline, I did make a Twitter post. It is pinned at the top of chat. Just go to my Twitter profile. It's on a, it's a recent tweet. If you have ideas later in the day, or like today or tomorrow, just leave a reply to that tweet and I'll look at it. Oh, wait, somebody suggested Fall Guys for another game. I, I'm down to do Fall Guys. I think it was Crystal on Twitter. Fall Guys. Omega Dance. Okay, so now that we've gone over the activities that I came up and chat came up with, what do you guys for sure want to see me do? What do you for sure, your favorite thing you want to see me do? I want to see drawings. Okay, so more art stuff in general. Now, another idea I had was the individual who donates the most during the stream, I'll make them like a custom something. I can make a, oh, can I make them a stamp? I could make them a custom stamp on stream. And then like, we could like make it the next day on the art channel. Thoughts? And also, I will be counting Cash App direct donations as well. Because I don't have donations through PayPal or anything. I just have Cash App. Because for the timer, it'll auto add time for like Twitch donations. So like bits or subs. But I can always manually add minutes. So like if we get it like a $5 Cash App, I'll have five minutes. Oof. And then I'll add here. There you go. Can you make a raffle? On my website, 
it would have to be listed as a separate product and i kind of want to keep stream stuff separate income wise from my art business because like just for tax reasons it's like you gotta report everything I don't necessarily want to do a raffle because I would feel really bad if people are like, because a raffle is like gambling, right? You're putting in money to like potentially win. I, I think it's probably better just to offer like something special for like the top dono or the top donator. I think that is like the most, not fair, but like, I don't, I don't want to do a raffle. Okay, do we have any more suggestions? Anything we for sure want to see? Just do the raffle for people who donate. I could do that. But what would I give away? A hollow card? <laughs> I could, yeah. Either way, everybody who donates will get their name written in, like, a card. Like we did last year. I'll have to find a specifically marketed, like, anniversary card. They probably get them at the dollar store. Let's do a separate section for rewards, then. I think I want to stick with Top Donator gets, like, special art. I don't know how I guess I could mail a stamp. I'd have to put it in an envelope. Cause I know some people when they do subathons, they will like for example, at different amounts of donations given, they'll give a specific thing. Like I think it was Emmy where if you gave five subs you got a free sticker. To everybody who gave five subs. And then 10 subs was like a free print. Everybody who gifted 10 subs. I don't know if I want to do that. That's like too much. How do I say work? <laughs> I, I I still feel like indifferent about doing this subathon. But like. Uh, I genuinely need capital soon. Because my sister said she'll buy my plane ticket, but she wants me to be able to pay her back by November. Because she had another trip planned, so... Like, the... Her and I both going sooner than anticipated is affecting her ability to go on that trip, potentially, so... Okay. This seems like a pretty good list. Thank you to everybody who chatted and participated and gave suggestions and ideas. Um, I will be finalizing this. And you will see the final result on Thursday, starting at 10 a.m. PST, guys. 30-hour potential subathon. Starting at 10 a.m. on Thursday. About the normal stream time. And then it could go till 4 p.m. on Friday. That would be crazy. And the reason why it's a 30-hour cap is because... I think it's kind of like a good homage, 10 hours for every year streamed. Makes sense. Yeah, guys, get your bits ready. Get your subs ready. And like I said, cash up donations will also count too, if you're in the US. But yeah, so that'll be on Thursday. Thank you guys for participating and helping plan this. I should save this somewhere. And I had, I think a chatter asked this earlier, but I still will be doing the cycle subathon at the very end of September. I'm I'm doing both. We're doing two subathons this year. So we're doubling up. But yeah, that's the plan. Because I think the cycle subathon is a good enough idea on its own versus the stream anniversary subathon, which is what we usually do anyway. Yeah, I have a I have an elliptical, like a stationary bike that I do every day. 
I, I usually do it once or twice a day. I did it this morning because I already... I had to cook this morning. I made chicken and dumpling soup. Okay, well, guys. The stream is almost over. But do not worry. We did get somebody redeemed with their channel points and a resubscription today. So, we get to do calligraphy. I know a short stream, short stream, but I got work to do. And a business phone call later. I have to prep the orders that were placed on Friday for mail. Okay. You guys know the drill. Use your channel points and I'll write your name or subscribe. But if we're going to subscribe, uh, wait till Thursday. Smile. While I'm getting the camera set up, if you could, make sure you're subscribed to my YouTube channel. Weekly stream highlights. Most recent video did pretty well. I played chess against my greatest enemy. Okay, let's hope I don't show feet. <laughs> Oh my god, there's two of me. Yo, no feet! Clean! I just have to not move my tripod. I also changed the color correction a little bit, so it's a bit... A bit more similar. Oh, also, I won't be starting this this week, but potentially in, like, August, I want to try and do at least one chess a game. Like, just to wrap up stream similar to how we do calligraphy every day. I printed off all the different chess, bot chess bots there are, and right now, I've beaten three. So my goal by the end of the year is to beat every single chess bot on chess.com. Hashtag not sponsored. That's my goal for the year. I would have done it today, but, like, I'm tired. Impossible? Mod, screenshot this, and then when I beat them, we'll ban Ethan. Beat them, I mean the bots. Physical encouragement? Exactly, that's why I printed it off. Oh yeah, I still need to do the Mario Party 8. Doing the... 
I think it's the star mode. We have to beat every single game board. Hi, cutie Lee. Once again, thank you for the 15 month resub. So close to my favorite number, 17. But thank you, cutie Lee. I appreciate your continued support. Done with the Oilers. Now time for the Brokies. Use your channel points and I'll write your name for free. Somebody needs to do the math and figure out the actual value of um, channel points for my channel. Wild. Ethan is actually here for the end of a stream for once. <laughs> I was lurking. Yeah, I'm just messing with you. I'm just messing. You know, the viewers who lurk in the background keeping a tab open when they're typing in their Excel sh sheets spreadsheets as they're working they're the real backbone of this channel thank you for redeeming electra not often somebody redeems black it's nice, though, because then my black marker is, like, fully inked. It's got a lot of juice. I think Spartan redeemed twice because there's two redemptions for calligraphy. There's rainbow, which is one per person per stream. And then rainbow, which is just once per user per stream. So the most that somebody could have their name written would be three times. It would be if they donated, if they redeemed rainbow, and if they had just regular calligraphy. The reason why I don't have rainbow redeemable multiple times is because it takes longer because I have to switch the pens. And you know, I don't mind stalling the stream, but like sometimes I gotta I gotta go. You know who else might need to go? The non-subs. Because guys, 
We're two hours in the stream. I have to run an ad. I'm sorry, but I got to do it. So if you want to avoid the ad, I got to do a subscribe for $5.99, just $6. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and subscribe for free. Ain't no way. This is like an olivey green. Okay, we have one more name left. If you want me to write your name, all you must do is use your channel points. Do so now. We're in the void. What? No, my camera's working. <laughs> or I guess some people are in the ad void, but you're not. Got a sunflower badge. Well, yeah, your lecture is so close to a year. If, even though you've only been chatting for like a little while, lecture, it feels like you've been here so long. Why is it only black for me? Uh, <laughs> Probably refresh then. Wait, I think if you're watching on mobile, Twitch just announced, like on their Twitter, that they're phasing out the, um, they're phasing out the old Twitch mobile app. So now everybody by the fucking end of the week will have the stupid cringe ass Tic Tac feed on their Twitch. So it could be just glitches in the ui because they're spacing out updates i know it's so dumb black and yellow black and yellow <laughs> do yellow flowers um if you want request give five subs right now okay anybody else this is your last call last call it works now okay yeah it's probably just your app glitching you know what twitch should update their tv app i watch twitch literally all the time on my tv and it's still really primitive <laughs> i'm rich in connections and poor in money why don't you understand damn get your money up not your funny up the twitch tv app is so bad i know it's so stupid because you know when you open a stream and then it defaults like your cursor defaults to like clicking on the user profile like, there's been so many times where, like, I've accidentally almost unfollowed, like, has done. <laughs> and I'm like, no! I almost lost my follow age! Okay, guys. Guys! I'm gonna wrap stream here for today's short stream, but I got work to do. I have a big business call. And then I also have to prep the artwork that I have to mail out that were ordered on Friday. So... The plan is simple. I will see you guys basically every day this week. Tomorrow stream. Wednesday stream. Thursday subathon. So we might stream on Friday. Who knows? Like I said, I will be finalizing the rest of the ideas that we talked about on the stream offline. And then go from there. So if you have any other ideas, you can submit them on my Twitter. I made a post. Just leave a reply and I'll read it. Surely. So tomorrow. Tomorrow is either finishing the Peace Lock run. Or random stream idea. And if I don't do peace lock tomorrow, we'll do it Wednesday. And then random stream idea tomorrow. It depends on, like, how I feel. Because, like, the way I do streams is, like, I have a list of things I want to do. And then I get ready, like, an hour or two before. I'm like, okay, I feel like doing this today. Or I feel like doing that. So, 
I don't like plan shit. Wait, that far in advance. I'm trying to think if there's anything else. No, that's all. Thank you for watching. If you want something to watch right now, new YouTube video, I Faced My Greatest Enemy in Chess, is actually doing really well. So if you missed it, if you missed the Chess Week's finale stream, there's a highlight already. Go click the link and go watch it now. And if you aren't already, make sure you're at least subscribed to my YouTube channel. You know, you get weekly highlights for free. Ain't no way. Yeah, thanks for watching, too. Hope you had fun. Um, yeah, that's all I got for you guys. No raids, nobody's live. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys had fun today. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Yeah, I'll be streaming tomorrow, Wednesday, and Thursday for sure. And Friday, if chat goes crazy. And before anybody asks, the I gift you a tier one sub will be disabled on the sub. Excuse me. Will be disabled on the subathon. You guys, I'm not donating to myself. <laughs> it is not happening. <laughs> also, something we didn't write down was just playing with viewers. Like, because last year we did Mario Party and Mario Kart. We can do that for sure for subathon too. Okay. I will see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye. Overwatch? No. I've seen too many. <laughs> Never mind. I'm not saying. I've only seen certain types of videos when it comes to Overwatch. <laughs> oh, wait. I'm playing the outro song too soon. Fuck it. You guys have one more minute left with me. I played the outro song accidentally. Do, 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 do. It was funny. I do the like Omega dance in, in real life now. It's so embarrassing. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow.